Okay, we're going to be, uh, we need to remove the fan clutch. So in order to remove the fan clutch, we have to uh, remove the, uh, the shroud assembly. And the way you do that is, we're going to disconnect the hose right here. We're going to disconnect the 10 millimeter right below the upper radiator hose. You can probably see it better from the back right here. We're going to disconnect that 10 millimeter screw there. And we're also going to disconnect this 10 millimeter screw here. We'll take these off. Push that little clip in and lift it up. Same thing with this one. Push it in and lift it up. And then we'll take the shroud off and uh, that's it. Okay, so they make a special tool to take this off. And it's actually, it's just a, a very large wrench that fits right onto the, the water pump right here. Now, if you don't have that special tool, a lot of times you can snap these loose just by uh, using a hammer. You slide the tool over the fan clutch and then you would just tap on it with the hammer to loosen it up. Um, uh, you remove them left hand. So you, you turn it to the left to get it to remove and you turn it to the right to tighten it back up. So you put your wrench on here like this and I'll show you how I usually get them loose. And you're just going to turn it left, take your hammer, just pull it, and you give it a couple of big shots. And one, two. Once it comes loose, you can just turn your fan off. That's it. Remember, it's left to take it off, right to turn it on. Clockwise off, cl counterclockwise off, clockwise on. We're waiting for the new one right now, but when you get the new one, this is exactly how you would put the new one back on. Reinstall it, is you just catch the threads and turn it till it's all the way on. Take your wrench, put your wrench onto it, tighten it until it's as tight as you can, and I'll show you what we do next. Just take it and just give it a couple of good shots. Now this is a demonstration just if you didn't have the torque wrench to actually tighten it back on, this is how you would do it. That's it. It locks it right on where it's supposed to be. Now we're just going to put our fan shroud back on. Show you what I did. All the way down below the hose is a clip right here. Make sure that the upper part of the shroud and the lower part of the shroud come together. The clip is in its position where it belongs right here. And the same thing on this side over here. Make sure that your clip is back into the lower part of the shroud. And then we're going to install the 10 millimeter bolts that hold the shroud to the radiator. Okay, once you've got the bolt tights, we're just going to reattach the pumps and they snap right in. Okay. 
And the last thing we're going to do is reattach the hose for the coolant. And that's it. Well, that's it. You're all set. All right, as always, thanks for watching, and I'll see you on the next one.